Hello, why am I Tradition? Welcome back to Hearts of Iron 4 as Fascist France, otherwise known as Vichy France to be exact. We've actually started World War II already. Uh, World War II, as you all know, started when Vichy France decided to invade Iraq and the UK went, no, we're protecting Iraq. And subsequently Vichy France uh, gave the two-finger salute and war erupted. Uh, Nazi Germany is called in. Nazi Germany was too busy talking about Anschluss and getting Austria on side to really do anything, which was a shame. Anyway, we're uh, currently fighting Iraq, we're currently fighting uh, the UK, uh, trying to push them out of Africa. They have all of their friends involved, like the whole Commonwealth is pretty much on their side right now, which is annoying to say the least. This is one of my concerns, actually. France in Indonesia actually has a single province of the United Kingdom here, followed by the British Raj. My suspicion is they're going to push through, so I'm going to try and put someone over here to blockade that. Try and do it as quickly as possible. By the way, this button here is strategic redeployment. I don't know what it... It makes you move faster, but you, like, suffer a penalty to your organization. Because, you know, you're traveling on a train or whatever. It's not particularly good for fighting. Although it does not seem to be toggleable one. I guess because you can't do it because it gives you an attack order. Come on. It's a move order. Oh, okay. But I go off it and then it's not toggled anymore. So I guess I'll just give you an attack order for now. Um, in fact, you are closer. You should do that. And you should take over protecting Hanoi. I don't fancy letting the British Raj push in and kick us out of our main rubber factory. I need the rubber produced down there. I can't forgo the rubber down there just to win the oil in Iraq. It's unacceptable. That said, facing the British Raj alone is a little bit um, galling. Okay. How's it going over here? Okay, so far. I'm kind of losing this push in Iraq for now. So I'm going to reset those, and I'm going to put you all... Yeah, that's good. So basically, I'm very much reducing the strength we have over here. In exchange, you should be getting a lot of reinforcements. I'm just going to tell you to stop pushing forwards. Just hold your position. You should do the same. Now, down here, how's it all going? You're moving into position. Good. I approve. All right, let's go a little bit faster. Ooh. Two more convoy ships. I very much like. We're missing tactical bombers still. Yeah. Okay. Push. Push. Do it. Oh, now, now push. There we go. Okay, you're enforcing. Iraq joined the Allies. That was to be expected. It's President Suno, if I'm completely honest. Yeah, I should sort that out. 91, 81. Ooh, it's not going well. Come on. Yeah, that's pretty much a stalemate for now. I will tell you to enact plan B, though. Why not? There's only one on that frontier. Japan joined the Axis. Excellent. Japan wants to help in their war effort. Oh, I have to face the People's Republic of China? In decline. I, I can't. I don't have forces in the area capable of fighting this. Venezuela wants to send two divisions to help. Sure. Yeah. Thank you, Venezuela. 
Appreciate it. Okay. There we go. We should be surrounding you pretty soon. How are we doing over here? We don't feel strong enough, apparently. Why do we not feel strong enough? Larger of coffin crossing and vision still preparing. I don't think you should have a problem. We do have S port in the area. Okay, how are we doing down here? Jim Wright declared war on Czechoslovakia and we finished our colonial military factories. Excellent. Well, we'll get around to that in a second then because something very important has just happened. We've just managed to push this province, which means you all get signed to this frontier. Right, I need to go one chip back here. Uh, Colonial military factories, excellent. There's more military factories, which is brilliant. We needed that. Um, getting the extra research slot, I'm really tempted. I think it's the thing we have to do right now. There are other things we can do, but the research slot is just so beneficial. Practice intervention. Um, okay, so this is... Nationalist Spain gains the nationalist intervention they like us more. Republican Spain hates us more. Can send volunteer forces. Um, gains the national spirit. Spanish Civil War intervention with grants. Divisions required for sending. No, we, we don't need to do that. The government pretty much guaranteed the war. We don't need to get involved. We can't because we're actually in a war, I think. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go for either nuclear or jet. Now, nuclear gives us a one time bonus of 50% to nuclear technology and rocket technology. But this gives us a massive bonus to jet technology. It's really tempting. If we can get an early jet technology, that pushes miles ahead of the competition. But this gives us a bonus to nuclear. Oh, it's so t I want to do both. I really want to do both. Uh, the four times research bonus for jet technology is great, but it's a very much future thing. But it does require you to have uh, a rocketry technology anyway. I need to pick one of these because I need the research slot like now. Um, actually, I need it as soon as the game began, but it's not possible until now. <sighs> and that gives us air experience. Let's check the um, timeline. So, 1944, you can get jet technology. Then, we can instantly get these, like with half the half the required speed. But we do require the jet technology for it. Alternatively, we can go nuclear. Now, the benefit is doing this early is we get minus 2% research time. Uh, I think we do it. I think we do uh, atomics. I, I would actually really want to do jets. Jets give us such an advantage in air warfare. But you require having rocketry anyway. So we'll do that. Oh, go away. Shoot. Had to go over here. Sunk two more. Sunk two more. Uh, missing production equipment. Okay, how's our production looking now? Hmm. Still working on it. I need to get some more fighter planes, so I'll push you to the top. <sighs> work, 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 work. Come on, we need those out soon. Just like it's called United Kingdom as our enemy in the French Iraqi War. <gasps> but they're already in. Oh, right, they got called into our war. Okay. Yes, we're out to take Baghdad. What is your national unity? 
70%. Yeah, it's going to be a little bit tough to beat you. Okay. Rock is capitulated. Yes. Philippe Petain has announced that the cowardly Iraqi nation could no longer withstand the pressure from the overwhelming presence of French forces throughout the country. The Iraqi government chose to, to flee the country and gone to exile. The main forces capitulated and Vichy France has now control of their home area. Though the war against what remains of the islands continues elsewhere, this is a great victory for all the exes. Yes. Okay, just very quickly. Um, get down here, capture that port. This is really, really good. Uh, I'm not going to annoy Iran just yet. I'm happy that I've got the oil. And I think that means we should check uh, trade. We haven't got the oil yet, actually. We've still got the same surplus from the Americas. Okay. Hey, kitty. Just knocking doors open, are you? Uh, call to arms across from Japan. Not yet. I'm going to keep declining for a while. Ooh, interesting. You've done a whole kind of invasion thing over here. You're crushing the face right now. Uh, all right. How are we doing? Two more. Seems to get sending back to the two. I don't know why we're having such a hard time against you. Oh, for God's sake. Cold arms. E every day? Every day. Go away. Shoo. No, no, no. Stop sending them. Stop sending them. One division's hungry has promised you to fight in uh fighting two oh, right, so basically they've sent one more to Tunis here. Alright, where's Tunis? Tunis, Tunis, Tunis. Hello. Um find. Yeah, I swore oh wait, that's them there. Aha! Okay. I didn't see you at the beginning. Okay, let's select you. Front line. And then quite simply, here's your order. This is ours. Finish it, finish fast. There we go. Just sheer overwhelming force now. Suez Canal is ours. Move over, mate. Ooh. Ooh, hello. The fall of Nanjing, the capital of the Republic of China. Nanjing is being occupied by forces from the Empire of Japan. Despite fierce resistance to the walled cities, Chinese defenders, Japanese troops managed to capture Zhong Gate and force away into the city. Okay, but Czechoslovakia has just given in, and this war is over. It's a mini-war, I think. I thought they were combined, but anyway. Um, we apparently scored points during this war. I don't know how. But Germany is like, awesome, I've done what I want, which is take all of this. Uh, we can now take some stuff ourselves if we want. I mean, we could be like, yeah, sure, I want these. That's too much. Okay, I could get, like, one. No, I can't. You can't waste a man's this turn, as that would lower your war score too far below the score of the next participant. I don't really know what that means. So I can't really do much. I can pass. Not that I actually really want Czechoslovakia. It's yours, Germany. Oh, I can have a bit of Czechoslovakia. Yay! Thank you. I don't know why I didn't deserve that, but sure. Yeah, I got a state. 
I have no idea what I did to deserve that, but I am pleased. Um, computing machine. Oh, yeah, sweet. Right, I need you to push in here and just finish this off so that we can, you know... Move people towards the actual front line. Currently, they're kind of sitting in the wrong place. Um, computer machine. That enables us to get encryption and decryption. Uh, basically, encryption prevents someone um, getting the bonus against you. And the bonus being decryption. You get an attack bonus if you can decrypt the enemy's uh, communications. I'm going to go for that. Yep, two every time. Three there. And three there. Okay, keep pushing forwards. Radio. Okay. Uh, I believe that means we can go... Yeah, radar. Right. Free civilian factories. Oh my god, the civilian factories are free? What is this? This is crazy. Um, naval base. Uh, yeah, we need more naval bases over here to be able to really fully support... Um, a good amount of supplies in the area. Uh, also... Anti-air. We need to start considering our anti-air against Britain. Uh, air bases. We'll think about that in a minute. I actually would like to get a few more... Uh... Oh, actually dockyards. Yeah, if we're going to start building a fleet, we need dockyards. But then military factories. All the way. Right. And there's a long list of things to be done now. Right. Free military factories. We've actually got more military factories. Yay! Uh, we're building these. So slowly getting up to speed. We need... Wow. We need so many tanks. This is kind of crazy. Um, inventory equipment. We're up to almost 100 per day now. Uh, what is needed? I guess we actually need to add a few more to artillery. And let's start working on some... I mean, the tactical bomb is not bad. Let's get a tactical bomber out. And then... A strategic bomber as well. So we need to start prepping them for our war against Britain. Ah, yes, we have resistance over here. You can station an army in an area that's got resistance to try and suppress it. Hmm. Very narrow gap here to get through. Come on, push, push. Oh, infantry equipment. We're a third of a year ahead of time, but I think it's worthwhile trying to grab this now. Now, of course, it does mean we'll need to replace the weapons on all of our troops, but it's worthwhile because it's really good. Battle plans, no units assigned. Ready? Um, no supplies. Yeah, well, we have pushed a long way around. If we can take these ports off the British, though, and that port as well, importantly, if we can take that port off them, and these ports, they will have no supplies. Come on, 99. 100. Bam. More convoys down. And yes, we managed to push in. Yep, you're falling back. 90... Come on, 6. Give me 96. 96. 97. 98. 99. There we go. Right. Now, this port's going to be the one that we care about. Then all the supplies have to come through here.
We're doing well. I'm very pleased by how this is proceeding so far. Let's just check uh, our trade. Uh, still getting oil in. Okay. Looks like Japan stopped asking us to join in the war. That's nice of them. Can I offer to join? Later on when I want. Whoops, wrong one. Join war. Yeah. I mean, they'll join my war. I will offer later on. Nuclear effort. Vichy France pursues nuclear technology. Following initial tests, the politicians of Vichy France have decided to direct French research towards the development of nuclear technology. The technology is still highly experimental, and there is great uncertainty whether it has any practical applications at all. Who knows where this might lead their war effort? We'll conduct our research in secret. Uh, this is like a world news. It's a newspaper. Um, but sure. Extra research slot. Straight up. Okay. That's where we're going to end today's episode. Rak is now ours. Uh, the United Kingdom are getting booted out. Slowly pushing our way down here, although we're going to need a few more troops um, if we're going to manage that. You know what? You've done well so far. Have some more troops. But anyway, I've been Erlissium. If you have enjoyed, please leave a like, not subscribe, please consider subscribing. Let me know down below how you think uh, the war's going. It's not even the start of World War II, like, in natural history, and we're doing okay. I have to be aware that the UK is going to be a very tough nut to crack, and the important part is to try and crack them before the United States really gets a foothold. Luckily, fascism's got a foothold over there, thanks to us pushing its popularity. Um, we could actually start considering pushing in other countries as well. Important part being the Soviet Union. They haven't got into any wars yet. I mean, the German Reich and they haven't even like started splitting Poland or anything. So it's so weird. Very, very early war. And Republican Spain is still a thing. Come on. Finish them off. Anyway, till next time.